Okay, Trent. Oh, I'm going to say hi real quick. Hi, by the way. So, um, again, we're at back outside again this side. Here's the one-car garage and the nice yard. And uh, there's storage in here. And there's actually another... Uh, this is kind of tight. Uh, bathroom in here. It's nice shape. Um, kind of an older, older tub. But uh, and then more storage back in here goes all the way back, I guess, into the garage, which we don't have access to. This, I guess, this door. They've just got storage in there anyway. Piano and um, sorry, uh, and just you know, kind of getting ready to hopefully sell the place and move out. So let's go back through. We're into the kitchen again. Um, you know, it's just a lot of funky, a little chopped up. So I don't know if you're gonna like that. So they did open this up. When they first bought it, there was actually a wall here and they never did really repair the floors. There's, this is where the wall was, which is fine. Um, I would maybe after you remodel, do the floors again. Another access to the other side yard, which is quite spacious and nice little ceiling fans. So here's the first hallway, um, small bedroom down here. Uh, they use it as a, one of the kids, a little closet. Um, I like the arched doorways, you know, cute features. So this is a 1940s home. And then they did the upstairs in 2007. So this was the whole house was just these rooms. They're just calling this an office, but they use it as a bedroom. This is not one of the bedrooms that they have on the count list. Um, I forgot what the listing said now. Five bedrooms, I think it is. But that's not one of them, but it, they use it as one. Um, bathroom. They, they did a lot of utility sinks, which is kind of funny. I think it's really a little odd. They do have the newer windows, though. So that's nice, double pane. Um, hi, me again. All right, let me, oops, shit. Excuse my language, I kicked the uh, scale. And I'll probably tip the scale if I got on it. But anyway, let me stop here for a second.